Today we will learn about Windows Movie Maker. Windows Movie Maker is a video editing software for Windows based computers. Earlier, it used to be a part of Windows XP. Now in Windows 7, it can be downloaded for free as a part of Windows Live Essentials that includes Mail, Messenger, Photo Gallery, Movie Maker, Writer, Family, Safety and other web-based services such as OneDrive and Outlook.com. With Windows Movie Maker, you can create movies from your photos and videos whether they are already on your computer or still on your camera. This software lets you create movies by using special effects, transitions and themes to make your movie stand out. You can make movies on various occasions like birthday parties and family gatherings by using Movie Maker. In just a few clicks, you can share your movies on your social networking sites such as Facebook and YouTube or upload them to OneDrive. Note that you can take a snapshot from a movie by clicking the snapshot button. Snapshot is present on the home tab in the ad group. Note that default extension of Windows Movie Maker project file is .wlmp. Now let us talk about features of Windows Movie Maker. Auto Save Projects are automatically saved after a fixed interval of time so that the data does not get lost in case of power failure or unexpected application closure. Download music from online libraries. Windows Movie Maker allows you to directly download audio files from online stores such as Audio Micro and Vimeo Music Store. Audio from a video. Audio track can be extracted from video files. Outline on text. Outline can be added on the text elements to improve visibility and appeal. You can also modify the outline color and size as per your requirement. Proxy video. Movie Maker uses a lower resolution video for previewing purposes so that the software runs smoothly on any computer. Audio Waveforms Audio can be represented as waveforms in Windows Movie Maker. This helps to locate the audio files easily in a project. Now let us understand how to start Windows Movie Maker. To open Windows Movie Maker, follow these steps. Click on the Start button, then All Programs, then Movie Maker. Now let us talk about components of Window Movie Maker. The components of Windows Movie Maker are shown below. Title Bar. It is located at the top of Windows Movie Maker window. It displays the project name and application's title. Title Bar also has buttons for minimizing, maximizing and closing the program. Menu Bar. It contains a collection of all the menus such as Home, Animations, Visual Effects, Project and View. These options allow us to access, edit and save the movies. Movie Maker button. It is located to the extreme left of the menu bar and contains features to create new project, open, save a project, import images etc. Storyboard. It is used to arrange and manage the video clips in our project. It also shows the transitions and visual effects when applied to the clips. Preview Monitor pane. On the left side of the work area is a preview screen. You will be able to watch your video here as you work on it. The advantage of using this pane is that you can see how the final result will look like and make modifications as required before publishing it. Now let us talk about adding images and videos. To create a movie in Movie Maker, first all of you have to import videos, images or audio files. To make a movie or a slideshow, follow these steps. Click on the Add Videos and Photos button present on the Home tab in the Add group. 
The ad videos and photos dialog box will appear as shown in the figure. Choose pictures category from the library's folder and select the sample pictures that you require. Click on open button. The selected pictures will appear in the storyboard or select all the images by using the shift key from the sample pictures folder. Click on open and all images will be imported in the Windows Movie Maker. Similarly, you can import video clips to the storyboard with the help of same button. All the imported images and videos are arranged in the storyboard pane as a film strip. You can customize the look of your storyboard by selecting the zoom in. Zoom out button on the zoom slider bar at the bottom right of the storyboard pane. Click on the play button in the preview monitor pane to preview the movie. Know the fact that in publishing video, you can directly share your movie on various websites such as Facebook, Vimeo, YouTube, Flickr, etc. The sharing options are available under the share group on the home tab. Know the fact that you can easily split your video clip in more parts and apply animation effects to it using the split button present on the edit tab in the editing group.